Hello my friends and welcome to the greetings application. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a greetings application that welcomes the user. So the first step, we will start by layout design. So we'll create the layout of this application using the layout editor in Android Studio. Then we'll move to the next step, which is declaring the views that we've created in the XML. The third step is adding the functionalities, creating functions, handling click events, getting user input, and so on. And the fourth step is running and testing the application, correcting the errors, the layout mistakes, and so on. I want from you to write these steps down on your copybook because these steps will follow in all of our applications. Okay, so let's start. Let's move to Android Studio and start creating this layout, then declaring the views and adding functionalities. So the first step, I'll create a um, the views app, or you can make it like a greetings application project. You can make a new project or you can uh, uh, write on the views application. Okay, don't worry, the same. We will start designing the layout. So the first, thing I needed is the edit text. I need an edit text that allows the user to enter his name. So the functionality of this app is the user enters his name in an edit text. When the user click on the button, it will display a toast message telling him that welcome, uh, welcome uh, Jack, welcome John, or whatever uh, the name is. This depends on the entered name in the edit text. Okay, so the width would be match parent, the height would be wrap content, the ID would be uh, edit text, edit, and um, uh, the hint, I will use the hint, please or enter your name, okay? And I will close it by this forward slash and this arrow. Now, I will add some constraints. I will drag and drop it here. I will drag this circle and this circle. So these are the attributes of the uh, constraints. Okay. This is the constraint layout attributes for the edit text. Now, I need a button. So I will create a button, wrap content, wrap content, ID is BTN, and the text inside it is called say hello. The background color, I prefer using the teal 700. I will drag and drop it or you can click on this infer constraint buttons. So you can see these are the constraints that is uh, that are added directly. Okay, when I click on this infer constraint. Okay, this is the simple, um, th simple app. I will use here another, I will change the background, so Android background and I will specify it from the drawable and now I will add the uh, the gradient uh, background this is the wallpaper I will copy it I will go to the drawables I will paste it here wallpaper one and now if I type the drawable slash wallpaper one it would be applying this wallpaper to the background of this uh, constraint layout okay now it becomes better in the main activity this is the most important thing which is the handling the functionalities so step number one is creating the layout step number two declaring the widgets Declaring the views or initializing the widgets, the same. We have three or two uh, widgets, the edit text, the val, 
edit text edt i will name it as edt it's of type edit text equal to find a view by id r.id.edt and val btn i will not make it a, a button in order to show you the different types so find a view by id here i should pass the type parameter which is a button okay the same as before okay so these are two different ways to to find a view by id in android studio using kotlin okay now when the user click on the button so i need to handle the click events so in the step number three which is handling the click events and adding functionalities adding functionalities btn dot set on click listener set on click listener i will add here the code that will be executed when the user click on it so i need to get and store inside a val or inside a var the same um a var entered text equal to edit text dot edt dot text okay then i will display a toast message create a toast message dot make text make text and i will pass the context as this the second parameter is hello and we need to use the enter text i am making a concatenation here between the hello string and the variable that we've created and get it from the enter text and the third parameter is the toast dot length long okay and we call the message that the show method here okay the three parameters are the context the text and the length of the toast okay and don't miss to call the show message okay now let's move to the fourth step i will run the program now in the emulator and here we go this is our application if we enter the name jack if we click on say hello the message hello jack will appear okay so hello jack if i change it to john if i click on say hello it will give me hello john so congratulations guys we've created the fir very first application the functional and functioning application which is the greetings application in kotlin so we've learned about the buttons the image view text views and edit text and how